A new made-in-Taiwan submarine that can carry two people has been tested properly for the first time. Researchers from National Sun Yat-sen University celebrated in Kaohsiung Harbor after their first manned submarine passed its test with flying colors. Next month, the researchers will take the vessel to the Liu Chao Island for further tests in ocean waters. A mini submarine descends five meters into the water at Zhongqin Shipyard. This was the first time the life support systems of the vessel were tested repeatedly by an operator. Although it was only in the water an hour, this is a big milestone for the team. The ups and downs emotionally were fine, but I did feel seasick physically. We had to make contact every five minutes. Its life support systems were okay. The speed and navigation systems can all function normally, which means we've already passed a gigantic milestone. Taiwan's first mini submarine weighs 3.5 metric tons and can carry two people inside. It's planned to be able to descend to depths of 500 meters below the surface, with a battery and life support systems that can handle eight hours. In case of emergency, the design should allow those inside to access oxygen, escape the vessel, and float to the surface rapidly. Of course, it can be fitted with other things, more toward the defense side, such as detection devices and the like. That's another avenue of application. Another very important task is underwater rescue operations. So basically, we are building this platform to suit all kinds of undersea needs. Apart from carrying two people, the vessel can stabilize its course while underwater, a first for the universities made in Taiwan submarines. The biggest challenge here is actually carrying people. Of course you need a life support system. That's an issue we never encountered in the last 10 years while developing unmanned technologies. The team plans to take the sub to the south coast of Liuqiu Island in October. There, they can try it out on the more hazardous ocean waters going down 20 meters below the surface and contending with ocean waves and currents.